okay so today I'm out here working um I am we got half the roof on now this is not by any means a barn this is just a simple cover for this and it's going to have a solid um back brace to get the a break from the north wind um you can see I have lots of help from the cat uh here's the tin for the rest of the roof um right now I am working with 80 of these one by sixes now i'm going to give you a tip if you shop lows at all and, and this is okay with me if you do because we found that if you buy a flat one by six that has been planed um, an extra time it is far more expensive than these dollar 68 fence planks they are exactly the same size across and i'll show you a one by six is is not a true one by six it's five and a half by three quarters I think and this comes out to five and a half and if you do this right here by three quarters so um, it comes out to measure the same width and the same uh, thickness I guess thickness is this side and width is here the only difference is these little things are cut off so we're actually gonna think if we might use that into because when we cut this off this is the only thing that I need right there. Um, two of these, however, will make six foot. So we might be making us a little diamond pattern in our wall over there. And it would serve for extra ventilation. So we'll see how that goes. I'm going to start with a door because it's perfectly square. And we're putting on new bottom braces across the bottoms. So I'll need the guys to help me do that. Um, lucky for me they're not here right now I just worked by myself so the doors are square and that's what I'm going to start with I've got two perfectly square spots to start with and from there we are going to actually frame these out in wood and put our planks in between them so it'll have a top rail and a bottom rail on the inside and then this will be planked in between so yeah it's gonna work great and like I said those planks by the way um, a one by six you can look it up in your area um, and see what it runs but these right here cost a dollar 68 just saying okay so we found these planks they are one by sixes and they're picket fence planks and we're going to use them to do these now these were originally two by sixes very heavy duty and because these are rusted and warped they won't fit back in there but what will fit in there is two one by sixes so this one is actually I've got to trim it just so it slides up but it's going to slide up it's got a hole where the two by sixes used to go in and I'm gonna use that we're gonna trim it and we're gonna have one plank across there in the center and have everything screwed to it so it'll all be secure it'll act as a spacer and it'll hold all the others in place then we'll evaluate to see if it needs one on the bottom and one on the top so I'm gonna start with the middle one and I'll show you how it goes in I'm cutting my boards and I'll show you how it goes in here in just a little bit. Okay, so I figured out how I'm gonna do the planks. Um, I don't wanna waste any. So I've got a, a top and a middle rail and a bottom rail, okay? Now remember, this is all supposed to be two by six is very expensive stuff. Those are my spacers. And then when I cut down, sorry, I had to put down the drill. When I cut one, it leaves enough that I can do another half. So I've already put up just a section so you can see. This is what it'll look like. And if you want to know if it's sturdy, and it's not even, I still have three more little planks to do. It is good and sturdy. Um, I don't want to leave the holes like that. I thought it would look kind of cool at first, and then I was like, eh, but I don't want to. Um, honestly, I could. <laughs> But I don't think so. Um, so I'll talk to RJ and see. But it is what it is. I think he wants them solid. So we'll see. 